Right. What the exact circumstances of their detention was. They had been sentenced yeah, to go to a, a, a prison camp at 12 years of hard labor, mm -hmm. and we don't know exactly what stage that ever got to. All right, well, let's watch this unfold. There we see them exiting the plane right now, and there we see their family members, and we're hearing the cheers. We're going to have to move. There's Yuna in the front there. Oh, wow. Hannah sort of says it all, doesn't she? Mm, gosh, it brings tears to your eyes just to see it. Um, she's just holding on. She hasn't even said a word. I think she nodded at her mom at one point. Um, you can just imagine how heartbreaking uh, these past few months have been. Um, and you think about all the other people. Uh, you still have three uh, people right now in Iran being held and, and many all over the world. Um, and there you see Al Gore, former vice president. We still haven't seen... Uh, President Clinton exit the plane. Yet. I'm sure he's hanging back. He just wants yeah. the family to have a moment. Boy, right. I'm not a dry eye in the house. <laughs> and here too. Wow. John, it was interesting to watch Ian Clayton, uh, who is Laura's husband, approach the plane. Uh, it was probably hard for you to see this, but you know he just kept on wringing his hands and he led the group up, up, up to the uh, plane.